One of the reasons that we've supported this technology and solar systems so strongly is that if we want to really achieve this vision of a, of a state and of a nation where we're getting more and more of our power from solar, we need to keep working on research and development and new technologies to increase the efficiency and the conversion ratio of solar energy. So I have three announcements uh, today. Uh, the first of those is that we are opening today a new $30 million grant program of sustainable energy grants. But again, this is all about helping our new businesses, helping those that are into bioenergy, helping those that are into geothermal, helping those that are into solar, so that we can give those small emerging companies the support and assistance that they require. Secondly, I'm particularly excited that we are establishing in the Department of Primary Industries and Energy a new Office of Solar Energy. We will be the first state to do this in Australia. So anybody uh, with any issues, wanting any information, with any proposals, with any investment proposals, wanting that support, wanting that coordination through government, will be able to get it through the Office of Solar Energy, which we are creating from today. And thirdly, I'm announcing today that we are setting up a medium solar working group. And you know, if you look across Victoria at the moment, we've got support, of course, from our feed-in tariff for rooftop solar. We've got support for large-scale solar through our large-scale feed-in tariff, which is what's supporting, of course, uh, projects like this and others that we want to see in the future. But we want to make further progress in relation to what we call medium solar. So this is things where you could have uh, an array of solar panels, might be on top of a major supermarket, for example, uh, might be on top of uh, one of the racing clubs, for example, uh, might be at one of our well-established airports where you've got large roof areas, well-positioned, north-facing, and we can get into the business of medium-scale solar development. Today, as you heard from the Premier, we're, we're making three announcements and they all, put it, they all fit together today with previous announcements that will clearly establish Victoria at the forefront of solar energy. And this supports and encourages Victoria as a crucible, as a place for new ideas in the renewable energy industry. The, um, the grants are now open. The detailed information is on the DPI website and uh, we hope to be able to um, be making decisions on these grants later on uh, this year. As you can see, we're busy uh, developing a, a world-leading technology. And uh, as pointed out by the Premier and the Minister, we are receiving material help, very significant assistance from the Victorian state government. So the key message from uh, the solar industry in Australia to uh, your government, Premier, is congratulations. Congratulations for showing the leadership that you are the initiative for solar in this country. In fact, you'd have to travel a long way around the world to find a state or provincial government which is anywhere near matching what is happening here in Victoria. It's a, it's a great story and we are very grateful for the assistance that the state government is providing us.